I have spent over $100,000 on mentoring and coaching programs, and here's what I've learned. The main learnings I'm gonna give here are structured around coaching businesses, SMMA businesses, and some sort of service-based business. If you own an agency or a coaching business, this is for you. The very first time I bought the program, which actually was expensive, and it was basically $36,000, it literally opened my eyes because I understood I have just spent $36,000 on a mentoring program. That means that I can also sell something really high ticket. And it was the very first time I actually understood that people are buying super high ticket things because I was already selling stuff for like thousands of dollars, but I was never selling things for tens of thousands of dollars. Now, of course you have to deliver, and this is the easiest to pull off when you are in some kind of money making niche, basically where you have a coaching business or an agency where the agency makes the client more money than they pay you. And if that is the case, it becomes very easy because let's say it's a sales mentoring program and you're already running a business and you get a bunch of clients and you have a bunch of sales calls. The argument for the closer, which is going to sell you something for $36,000 is this. Do you think over the next year, you're going to make more than $36,000 if you learn how to sell better? And that's what we're going to teach you. The answer to that is yes. Obviously, if your closing rate improves by 20%, you will make way more than 36K. It means that it's a positive investment and you should buy it. And that argument is valid. It's actually correct that you need to buy something which is going to make you more money. This program for 36K, it was basically a program structured around how to build a coaching business. The main learnings I had here was number one, sales. First of all, through the guy who closed me on that program, I learned so much because the way he sold me the program was literally 25 calls. He did not stop calling me. He did follow up like a maniac and he knew that he's doing a favor for me and he was right. I'm actually very thankful that he pushed me to buy it because it made me way more money. Now in the program, I've had a couple of golden nuggets. The first one was me sitting actually together live with the owner of the company in some shisha bar in a small city. And this guy basically literally looked like he's from the Albanian mafia. And he sat down with me and we did objection handling for like two and a half hours straight. We're just sitting there and I was throwing objections at him and he was throwing objections at me. And it was basically this role play of sales. And every time we did this, he corrected me if I did a mistake. Literally that shisha sitting alone was worth way more than the money I paid because my closing rate literally jumped to 85%. And before that, it was less than 60. The second thing it told me is that the prices I was charging were too little. And I started increasing price and it just worked. Nobody dropped off. I added like $1,000, nothing changed. I added $500 even more, nothing changed. If you just sell something more expensive, in most cases, nothing is going to change. And the conversion rates are going to stay the same. You are just more profitable. And I know you might probably think, yeah, but in my niche, it doesn't work. Did you try it? And if no, don't even think about it. I guarantee that someone in your niche is charging higher prices than you and they pull it off. And that means that you can also pull it off if your marketing and sales are good enough. And obviously, if you can also deliver. The next lesson was this. At the time, I was basically having one hour a week calls with my clients. And that took so much of my time. And what we changed was we basically decreased it to two 10 minute calls a week crazy amount of time was saved. And on top of that, I noticed how everybody was super prepared. They come into the call, ask question, bam, 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 done. Because they know they only have 10 minutes. So we need to move fast. And that pushed everybody to think of questions, to think of relevant things, and it made everything better. And again, you might think it's not possible, but try. Try to do 10 minute calls. If it doesn't work out, do 15 or 20 minute calls, but I'm almost sure 10 minutes are gonna be enough. The other thing I learned in the program was I saw how students of their program became coaches in their program. And I implemented the same thing. I basically understood the people who I already taught can teach the new people. And they are gonna do it as good as me because I taught them. So if you struggle with replacing yourself, you just take a person who you already taught. And the amount I saved was just incredible. And the biggest golden nugget I've actually gotten through the programs was the advice to start a YouTube channel. And this was something which just changed the entire business. We literally were stuck for so long at around like 50K a month and we couldn't scale. I started the YouTube channel literally within a couple of months, instantly scaled to six figures a month. It was that simple. We had the foundation already. I just needed to be in front of the camera and say what I'm already saying in the sales calls to the camera. And then the camera, much more people are gonna see it, means that much more people are gonna buy my stuff. If you're actually interested in how it looks, you can just type in Michael Bernstein and the YouTube channel is gonna pop up on YouTube and just do one thing. Scroll down to the very first couple of videos and look how terrible they were and look at the new ones and look at how good they look. And just understand that that's a very natural process. And trust me, the videos before the ones I actually posted were way worse, all right? The ones I posted were already semi-good in comparison to how it looked before that.
basically what I'm getting at is it's a skill. You don't need to be this Adonis looking, tall, charismatic guy like this guy to actually start a YouTube channel. Because if you actually are an expert in some field and you just convey it with a good tonality, you look into the camera, talk like a regular human being, after a couple of months, you're gonna get good at it anyways, and you will make a shit ton of money if you do this right. It can actually be very frustrating and difficult and you're gonna have tons of challenges on how to get this started. And that's why we've built this agency where we're gonna help you build a YouTube channel from scratch. Or if you already have an existing YouTube channel, just scale that. It's basically gonna be a mix of paid ads and organic. After we teach you how to make a good video and we're literally gonna look over your shoulder until it's good, then we're basically gonna start running discovery ads where you get suggested on YouTube more on the top video. And that's gonna basically help you grow. However, it was such a pain to learn this in the beginning. It was actually really complicated and we did so many mistakes. And that's why we have this agency just to make your life easier and basically get a cut from the profits. If you're interested, click the link below. You can sign up for a call with me personally. We're gonna find out if everything is a good fit. If yes, we're going to start working together. If no, then not.